Okay, this first one is going to be Circa. Circa is downtown on Fremont Street near the Main Street, across the street from Plaza, right next to the California, and also Fremont Street. So it's kind of in those little four corners there. But this is going to be a 777 room hotel with uh, giant pools on top. And just right across the street is their parking garage. They're calling this Garage Mahal. And when you get there, they're going to treat you like royalty as you cross over. There's going to be a crosswalk that goes right to the hotel. So that's going to be kind of cool. But I'll keep you guys updated on what that's going to look like as things progress with this. But they do about a floor a week. And they want to get this done before the uh, football season for the Raiders and all this uh, other stuff that's coming here as well. But you can expect this by, what, late 2020 for this to be done. And um, also the canopy at Fremont Street's brand new. So I thought I'd mention that because you can see it right there. But that's a 4K canopy as well but a lot of stuff going on on Fremont and we're going to head to the next project what is basically it's right next door this is a grand hotel downtown and they've got a tower that uh, they're building there they're just going to expand on what they already have and this is what it looks like so far so they're building pretty quickly there as well and um, at the bottom floor I'm not sure if that's going to be the new valet going in and things like that but uh, looks like the uh, place is looking pretty good with their new tower. But these are going to be suites and they're not going to be like little hotel rooms. They're going to actually be something fairly larger for people that stay there. Also, while we're down here, Fremont Street is getting a boost. As you can see, the middle section of that used to have the martini glass and other uh, fixtures that say Las Vegas and all this stuff. But... Uh, yeah, that stuff's been moved off to the side. They have trees planted on the side, so those are all brand new trees. Uh, it's fall here, so of course I got cut off by a truck, so never mind that. The sidewalks are bigger. It makes more room for people to walk, and the trees are going to add more just shade and cooling areas in and around the area, but they're going all the way down Fremont Street. So Resorts World is a very anticipated hotel being built uh, right on the Las Vegas Strip, right near the Encore and the Wynn, and uh, it's going to be a monster of a build here. But this is uh, expected to be done in mid-2021, uh, summer of 2021. And right next to it is uh, what used to be the Fountain Blue is now the Drew. That is a 2023 uh, opening of that one. So they're doing a lot of design work in that. So it's going to take them a little bit longer. But I'll keep you guys updated on these projects as they progress. And just right across the street and Kitty Corner 2, the, uh, the Drew there, is the Las Vegas convention center expansion project that is going on and they're putting in the glass they're making some very good headway in this and they want this done by next year ces which is uh, 2021 and they are doing a good job this is a huge project this is a lot of uh, floor space for new projects and new conventions that are coming here and I don't know if you guys heard that Oracle from San Francisco is coming here that's about 65 million dollars added into the economy here in Las Vegas so that's going to be a big deal and I will be at CES this year doing a walkthrough with a lot of stuff and showing you guys the latest tech on what's going on so stay tuned for more of that kind of stuff and let's get on to the next Next one. This next one is Madison Square Gardens and they're bringing some tech into Las Vegas just behind the Venetian Palazzo area and this is called The Sphere. The Sphere is a giant concert venue slash presentation venue that you can definitely get an immersion type experience with this one. But expect the MSG Sphere to be done by 2022 and it is going to be a big mammoth project. And I'll keep you guys up to date on all these going into the 2020 
year. All right, let's move on to the next one. This next one is the Caesars Forums Convention Center. It's just right behind the high roller and it is almost done. They have to have this one done by April of 2020 for the 2020 NFL Draft and many other projects that are coming into here. So keep a lookout for Caesars Forums Convention Center. And a couple of minor projects that are just wrapping up on the strip there is uh, Target is going to finish up there before uh, springtime. They're just right across the street from Park MGM. And also the pedestrian bridge that's going to be finished up here pretty soon. I believe this week before Christmas you'll be able to walk on that and walk safely across the street of the boulevard there right on the strip. And let's move on to the next one which is our final project. Of course, it is the granddaddy of them all, the Raiders Allegiance Stadium project, which is making a lot of news lately. Everyone's pretty excited about this, but it is going to be finished by 2020. It has to be done by July because the Raiders are coming here to play football and also the UNLV Rebels will also be playing college ball there too as well. So this is going to be a great and exciting year for Las Vegas as all these projects come to a head and I'll keep you guys updated on what they're going to look like and we'll do walkthroughs and show and tells as things move along here in Las Vegas. So hey guys, that pretty much wraps up our top 10 Las Vegas construction projects going into 2020. But hey, give this video a thumbs up and let me know what your favorite project is in this video. Hey guys, we'll leave some links down there for our social media pages. So if you're a fan of like Twitter or Facebook or these other platforms, definitely check us out. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. All right, cheers. Thank you.